Hey good people, it's your girl Bomb Jalam. It is time for me to get into another WNBA reaction. This one is going to be for the Minnesota Lynx versus the New York Liberty. So yeah, um, I like to watch these games just to say, I guess, abreast on everything that's going on in the WNBA League. I don't, I'd like to watch the games more often, so doing these reactions helps me to do so. And then also, you know, I want to show love to this part of the league too, because it's not as, um, it's not shown as much like uh, broadcasting and um, exposure and stuff like that as the NBA. So yeah, I just wanted to get into this reaction and I'll talk about the players that stood out to me and stuff like that at the end of it. Liberty, Sugar Rogers, Brittany Boyd, Marissa Coleman, Tina Charles, and Kia Vaughn. And yeah, that same old dangerous five for the Minnesota Lynx. Simone Augustus, Lindsey Whalen, Maya Moore, Rebecca Brunson, and Sylvia Fowles. Jeez, we were watching them in their shoot around. It was so interesting to see as Kia Vaughn scores there. Mm. Oh, the bigs inside. 6'6", six, six, and you have 6'8", with Griner and Cam Beige. Well, well, six zone, zone more often. Yeah. But you know what else is interesting about the zone? As Sugar yeah. Rogers yeah. knocks aside. Yeah, yeah, Minnesota's having great success getting that ball into Sylvia well, Fowles. because I got big. I got <laughs> Into two post players, but you can't be 6'6", six, six and ask to not be called big. <laughs> okay, that is not a request that I... Always, you know, the... the Thing at six five, six six, and big. I got you. I got you. I'm just saying, though, in the uniform. Why is, the, why is the Liberty so you know, terrible at the rim? This is we see another big and easy score. By Literally, they keep getting the, the same room. shots off them. It's but like I also five like the challenge. Like yeah. she's facing yeah. up on these bigs. The Lynx keep scoring on them. Or turnovers. That enables That's them crazy. to get early post touches without the defense. And you see Tina Charles take. personnel I shouldn't have went out on Daniel Robinson in the corner knowing that she likes to drive instead of being a shooter so just getting on on um special player and she she had that from day one I mean she had that when she came in she didn't know what she knows now in terms of experience but she always had that drive why are they so bad look at them they were the all range jumper because she changes the pace right away when she comes in the game and they just let but that's shot going to really be beneficial to them as they get more from their bench and there's a Nice. Right, the offensive rebound. Nice fake flyby by Bria Hartley. And that's just Tina Charles outworking her. Lena Larkins on the offensive block. <laughs> Charles be going hard. Huh? Nice flash. Oh, that was a nice executed play there. Quick. Well, for me, I would just never have my body where Sylvia could find it. Because if you allow her to know where you are, you're already job of getting down there. Now, Tina Charles with that fadeaway, though, just like you talked about. Yeah, I mean, I, I think she's pretty done it. To the basket here with the spin move. Nice. What? Ugh. That was tough. Off the glass. The fire she brings when she's out on the floor. But uh, you know, your career obviously evolves, and Reeve has at her disposal is helpful. Well, also, Karis, the leadership, right? When you talk about the intake bounding, and they are struggling right now from the board with the boards. Six rebounds as fresh as she could come playoff time. Their bench seems to be figuring it out. And how about Zowie B? I mean, up and down the roster, nice pass there by Brunson. Mm -hmm. And games where she's been a non-factor. And that's been the challenge for, for New York all season long, is finding enough players consistently. And block shots and just the rotation on defense. And Rebecca Brunson, they don't win championships without me. So she, I mean, just yeah, now she's obviously the WBA's defenses. leading rebounder. And I'm, I'm really so proud mm -hmm. of her. To get to the rack and wait, what? Come on, ref, that was an and one. Spread out wide for me when you talk about playing a 2 3 zone and keeping that ball out of the middle. Oh, tough to guard, right? I mean, Brunson and Tina makes her pay. They want to 
tosses you over and gets in the air. It's, it's good. Yeah, it's the new thing, the bold north. I got gotcha. you. That's a bold. Yeah. Okay, team. No. Damn, she oh, took nice. off. Push out. Jeez. All right, let's oh. see. Okay, boom. Now here, watch. Push it out. Push it out. Go get it, big girl. Turns around. No one's on my heels. Goes in with she one hand. She took hit. off. Houston yeah. came out and sang the national yeah. anthem before the mm -hmm. game. It was one of the cooler, more remarkable. Tina Charles has, has gotten off to a great start here tonight. I mean, 19 points, eight rebounds. I talked to her a couple of weeks ago, and I was just telling her I'm impressed with her game, but also impressed for the person that she has. Uh, the the passion yeah. that you brought. You were booable. Yeah. Hey, I was. Oh, should have passed that mm. inside. Tina Charles got it anyway. Big girls. Too much patience. Great patience by Sylvia Files. Assess it, the double team, make your move. Oh, big girl wow. put him on the back. He has to win with their defense. That's just a pick. One of the issues. Great steal by Maya Moore. Mm. Finished by Rebecca okay. Brunson. Almost finished by Rebecca Brunson. She cleaned it up. Great pass. You know, I, I think Brittany oh, Boyd. Nice. Ha oh, I'm telling you, that fly. Quickness. Good looks. Yeah. You have many different variations of it. Right. The side you want to go under, you go over, depending on the defense. And yeah. It's it, it's players doing that same play. You know, the thing about floppy that. It takes that as you see Tina Charming, goodness gracious. Tina <laughs> okay, Tina Charming, the most phenomenal game tonight. But play. stepping back from that three point shot, that's money. And you know what's interesting about Tina Charles' shot? She didn't, she never jumps off the floor. Dang. And you see Danielle Robinson step right in, in Atlanta. You should just have seven threes in a game. Yep. Mm, save it. Uh oh. oh. Amanda Zowie B and Bria oh, Hartley. No. Didn't see what happened there on that play. Carried off the floor. This is. Oh, she stepped. Oh, she stepped on it hard. Oh, wow. Oh. It didn't look like much of anything there. Shelby Zowie B to a closeout. Oh. Yes. You know what? That's important. Yeah, nice. I mean, that's it. Uh, it's a nice play. I mean, that's Tina coming off the pin down. We saw it in the first half. Heard that. <laughs> Neither does Minnesota. <laughs> yeah. Oh. You have your center coming off the double screen. Yeah. So they don't want to tire her out. They don't want her to get into foul trouble. But hold on. You're telling me that the official who's standing right there needs to go and check if this is a hostile act? You're right there. Usually when you go to the... But my point is that they should know that when you're right there. Yeah, which is interesting now. You can't keep still off the board. See, there it is from Boyd. I mean, when she does. Yeah, see, there it is. That, that's really nice. That's a rescreen. So, Brittany Boyd, you're not going to. Close. Down, to the wire. Opponent. down to the wire. Oh. Teams, they don't move, they're not moving Damn. the ball around as much as they were. She don't get this? Wow, what a show. Ooh. What a play. Um, no way. Uh-oh, uh -oh. oh, oh. Is it going to go to OT? Ooh. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. <gasps> Three-quarter front by Brunson, really good, and then another yeah. defensive play by Rebecca. Oh. Wow, that's true. It's over. Maya Moore it's hits both free throws. I'm surprised New York didn't use their last time out. Well. There it is. I've been noticing Tina Charles though. She's been like beasted. The games I've been watching so far this season, featuring her, she's been like really going in. Uh, of course, y'all know how my how good Maya Moore is. Sylvia Fowles, is, Sylvia Fowles is a good player as well. Um, but I do notice that the Liberty, they are kind of. Defensively, they need some work. I, I actually noticed this. The game I watched where they played the Dallas Wings earlier this month, it was kind of like the same thing. But they, they were also off on the offense as well. So I don't know. They might be like another good power forward to kind of help them on that end. But other than that, this game seems very competitive. Um, and yeah. If you have any requests for reactions, you guys feel free to let me know down below in the comment section. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.